Hey everybody, this is Tony. And this is Paul, and we're coming at you from the Friends for Life podcast, where we discuss the ongoing lives and issues of people with developmental disabilities to spark positive change in the field. And we have a lot of fun doing it. Friends for Life Residential Care, specializing in support for individuals with developmental disabilities, offers services like adult day support and home health care. Emphasizing empowerment and quality of life, we live by the motto, my ability is stronger than my disability. We are currently hiring, welcoming those passionate about making a difference. Learn more and explore career opportunities at friendsforliferc.com. I'm Dr. Craig Eskide, President of Intellectability. State developmental disability agencies, managed care organizations, and providers across the United States use Intellectability's health risk screening tool, e-learn courses, and person-centered training to improve health equity for people with IDD. Visit ReplacingRisks.com to learn more about how you can employ these tools with people you support. The history of care with people with disabilities in the United States reflects a long and evolving journey towards inclusion and equality. This journey, marked by significant shifts in attitudes, policies, and practices, began in an era when individuals with disabilities were often marginalized and institutionalized. In the 18th and 19th centuries, care for people with disabilities were largely informal, primarily provided by families, with few public or organized efforts to support these individuals. The concept of institutionalization gained momentum in the 19th century, leading to the establishment of asylums and hospitals designed to segregate people with disabilities from the rest of society. These institutions were initially seen as progressive, aiming to provide specialized care. However, they often became places for neglect and abuse. The early 20th century saw the eugenics movement gain influence in the United States of America, promoting policies for forced sterilization and restrictive immigration laws to prevent the spread of disabilities. This dark period highlighted a prevailing view of disabilities as something to be eradicated rather than accommodated. The post-World War II era marked a turning point as veterans returning with disabilities prompted a shift in the public perception and policy. The civil rights movement of the 1960s and 70s further catalyzed change, leading to activism by the people with disabilities. This period saw the emergence of the independent living movement and emphasizing autonomy and self-determination for people with disabilities and challenging the traditional model of care. Legislative milestones began to reshape the landscape of disability care and the rights. The Rehabilitation Act of 1973 prohibited discrimination on the basis of disability in federal programs and services, laying the groundwork for future legislation. The landmark Americans with Disability Act, the ADA, of 1990 further solidified these rights, prohibiting discrimination in employment, public services, and accommodations. Today, care for people with disabilities in the U.S. is guided by principles of inclusion, accessibility, and equal opportunity, reflecting a significant transformation from practices of the past. Community-based care, inclusive education, and employment opportunities are now prioritized, supporting the full participation of individuals with disabilities in society. While challenges remain, the trajectory of the history shows a clear move towards recognizing and respecting the rights and dignity of people with disabilities. Making sure that individuals are reaching the goals they have set for themselves. That's one of the many goals of Assured Health Services. If you're looking for a residential care provider or search for ADS services, Assured Health is your go-to place. Assured Health, helping others succeed. Learn more at assuredhealthohio.com or call 419-442-8066.
THS Remote Supports is clearly focused on improving independent living through dynamic and personalized services. Their systems have been carefully developed and perfected to ensure that everyone receives the best care through the least intrusive means possible. Located in Cincinnati, Ohio, they've spent over 20 years providing in-home supports to individuals with disabilities. If you or someone you know is looking for a remote service provider, go to THSRSS.com or call 513-882-9088. The Reliable Drug and Alcohol Testing Clinic is a leading provider and convenient source of pre-employment and occupational type testing. Their clinic provides services to a wide range of private businesses, healthcare facilities, and municipal and county courts. Reliable is an independent, locally owned clinic. As a result, they provide their services at a lower cost than the major hospitals, have faster turnaround times on test results, and eliminate the long waits typically incurred at these larger facilities. To learn more, visit ReliableDrugTest.com. 